Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Google Chrome as a web browser for quite some time now has been able to and carried support for the AVIF image format in the browser. And as we can see from this uh, test page, is your browser capable of displaying AVIF images? Your browser software supports AVIF. Now, in case you're unaware and what AVIF is and what it stands for, a brief overview would be it stands for AV1 image file format and it can store both still and animated images with the .avif file extension using lossless or lossy compression. And um, if you didn't know, AV1 compression will eventually replace the older HEVC standard, which as we can see in Google Chrome, that has already happened. Now, if we just hop over and head over to Microsoft Edge Canary, which is a preview version, in Microsoft Edge, and that's in the stable version of Edge and also all the different preview versions, there is no support currently for the AVIF image format in Microsoft Edge as a web browser. But this could be all set to change. And um, recently, Microsoft has started to roll out a flag, which is a good indication that they could start officially working on and testing AVIF, uh, the image file format in Edge as a browser. Now, uh, this flag is not your, what we would call a normal experimental flag. And um, this is a command line flag. And to enable a command line flag, it's a little bit different to a normal experimental flag. And because it's a command line flag that's been made available, it does show us that it's still very early days. So there's still a bit of work to do on the uh, image format in Edge as a browser. Now, to enable the command line flag, um, what you need to do is just head to a shortcut of Edge Canary. So be that a shortcut on your desktop, in your start menu, or on your taskbar as an example. And just right click on that shortcut. And then click on properties. And here you'll see your target. Now I have already entered the command line flag because um, it does take a good couple of seconds to uh, relaunch the browser after you have applied this flag. So just to get on with the video and not waste your time, I've already enabled it. But what you need to do is you'll see uh, in the original target, it'll end with .exe quotations. You need to leave a space after those quotations in the target and then enter this command line flag. Enable features MS Edge AVIF and don't worry, I have um, already um, drawn this uh, command line flag up and I'll leave uh, this in the description so you can just copy and paste that command line flag in for easier access and reference. So enter that command line flag after the quotations, leave a space, you must leave that space and enter that flag. Click on apply, click on OK. Then you'll have to close Edge Canary and then relaunch it to apply that flag. And as mentioned, it could take a good couple of seconds on the first launch. So just be patient to apply all those different changes. And now if we just head over and back to the same website, which I showed you over in Google Chrome, um, we can see now AVIF and it does support the image format now because um, it says if your browser can display AVIF files, it will, else a fallback JPEG picture will be used and we're not seeing a fallback JPEG picture. So that means uh, Edge Canary can now display and does carry support now for AVIF, uh, the image format. And as mentioned, this is not available yet in the stable version. So you won't be able to use this command line flag in the stable version. And obviously, um, this is early days, but there is a very good chance because as I did mention, this this format is um, uh, replacing older formats. So there's a good chance this will roll out to an up and coming stable version in the future. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.